Quantum mechanics is a branch of physics that describes the behavior of particles at the atomic and subatomic level. It has been incredibly successful at predicting the behavior of quantum objects, such as electrons and photons. But it also poses some of the most fundamental questions about physics. One of the most puzzling aspects of quantum mechanics is the measurement problem. At the heart of the measurement problem is the wave-particle duality of quantum objects. According to quantum mechanics, particles can exist as both waves and particles simultaneously. It is only when they are measured that they appear to collapse into one definite state. This collapse of the wave function is a mysterious process that has puzzled scientists for decades. It seems to suggest that the act of measurement has a fundamental effect on the outcome of the experiment. The measurement problem refers to the difficulty of reconciling the wave-particle duality of quantum objects with the act of measurement. It seems that the act of measurement collapses the wave function and determines a definite outcome, which is at odds with the idea of particles existing in multiple states simultaneously. To put it simply, the measurement problem is the question of how a quantum object can exist in multiple states simultaneously, yet, upon measurement, collapse into one definite state. The measurement problem has been a topic of debate since the early days of quantum mechanics. In the 1920s, the Danish physicist Niels Bohr and the German physicist Albert Einstein had a famous debate over the nature of quantum objects and their measurement. Bohr argued that quantum objects exist only as probabilities until they are measured, at which point their wave function collapses and they take on a definite state. Einstein, on the other hand, believed that there must be some underlying reality that exists independent of observation of the particle. This debate was further fueled by the famous double-slit experiment, which showed that particles could behave as both waves and particles simultaneously. This experiment raised questions about the nature of reality and the role of measurement in determining the behavior of particles. In 1935, the Austrian physicist Erwin Schrödinger proposed a thought experiment that highlighted the paradoxical nature of quantum mechanics. The experiment involved a cat in a box with a radioactive substance that had a 50-50 chance of decaying and releasing a lethal gas. According to quantum mechanics, until the box is opened and the cat observed, it exists in a state of superposition where it is both alive and dead simultaneously. This thought experiment brought the measurement problem to the forefront of scientific debate. Over the years, various interpretations of quantum mechanics have been proposed in an attempt to reconcile the paradoxes of the measurement problem. These interpretations include the Copenhagen interpretation, the many worlds interpretation and the pilot wave theory in addition to many other theories. Despite decades of research, the measurement problem in quantum mechanics remains one of the most intriguing and challenging aspects of the theory. However, various interpretations of quantum mechanics have been proposed in an attempt to reconcile the paradoxes of the measurement problem. Let's take a closer look at some of the most popular interpretations. The Copenhagen interpretation named after the city where Niels Bohr worked, is perhaps the most famous interpretation of quantum mechanics. According to this interpretation, quantum objects exist only as probabilities until they are measured, at which point their wave function collapses and they take on a definite state. This interpretation emphasizes the role of the observer and the act of measurement in determining the behavior of quantum objects. Another popular interpretation is the many worlds interpretation, which proposes that every possible outcome of a quantum experiment actually happens in a different universe or branch of reality. In this interpretation, the wave function never collapses, but instead the universe splits into multiple versions, each corresponding to a different outcome of the experiment. The pilot wave theory, also known as the de Broglie, Bomb theory is a deterministic interpretation of quantum mechanics. According to this theory, quantum objects are guided by a pilot wave that determines their behavior. The wave function is not a mathematical construct, but represents the actual position and momentum of particles. Finally, the decoherence theory proposes that the wave function does not collapse, but instead becomes entangled with the environment, leading to the appearance of classical behavior. In this interpretation, 
The measurement problem is not a fundamental problem of quantum mechanics, but rather a result of our limited ability to observe the universe. While the measurement problem remains unresolved, experimental evidence has shed light on the nature of quantum mechanics and the different interpretations proposed to solve the problem. One key experiment that supports the Copenhagen interpretation is the delayed choice quantum eraser experiment, which demonstrates that the act of measurement can affect the outcome of a quantum experiment even after the experiment has already taken place. On the other hand, the many worlds interpretation has been supported by experiments such as the quantum Zeno effect, which shows that repeated measurements can prevent a quantum object from evolving into a different state. This result is consistent with the idea that every possible outcome of a quantum experiment actually happens in a different universe or branch of reality. Recent advances in technology have allowed for more precise measurements and tests of quantum mechanics, and these results may shed light on the measurement problem. For example, researchers have used entangled particles to demonstrate the violation of Bell's inequality which suggests that quantum mechanics cannot be explained by any theory that allows for local realism in it. In addition, experiments with quantum computers have demonstrated the power of quantum mechanics for certain tasks such as factorization and cryptography, highlighting the potential for practical applications of the theory. While these experiments provide valuable insight into the nature of quantum mechanics, they also raise new questions and challenges for the different interpretations proposed to solve the measurement problem. The measurement problem in quantum mechanics has far-reaching implications for our understanding of the nature of reality and the limits of scientific knowledge. It raises fundamental questions about the role of measurement and observation in determining the behavior of quantum objects and challenges our intuition about the relationship between the observer and the observed part in the quantum space. Some interpretations of quantum mechanics suggest that the universe is fundamentally indeterminate and that the act of measurement merely selects one possible outcome from a range of possibilities. This implies that our understanding of reality may be limited by our ability to observe it and that there may be aspects of the universe that are inherently unpredictable. At the same time, the peculiarities of quantum mechanics also offer exciting possibilities for practical applications such as quantum computing and cryptography, among others. These fields rely on the ability of quantum objects to exist in multiple states at the same time and to be entangled in ways that allow for powerful computations and secure communication. However, the measurement problem also raises questions about the limits of these applications. If the act of measurement itself is problematic, how can we be sure that the results of a quantum computation are trustworthy? And if the act of observation affects the behavior of a quantum object, how can we ensure the security of quantum cryptography? These are just some of the many questions and challenges posed by the measurement problem in quantum mechanics. As we continue to explore the fascinating world of quantum mechanics and its implications for our understanding of the universe, we'll delve deeper into these issues and their potential impact on science and society. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the quantum world, it's clear that the measurement problem will remain a central challenge to our understanding of the universe. But it's also a source of wonder and inspiration as we discover new ways of thinking about the fundamental nature of reality.